Good morning everyone. Today we are in Bangkok. We are headed to Chatuchak. And as I've said before, we pretty much never will pass through Bangkok without a visit. Today's video, we're gonna try to give you guys a look at reptiles. What reptiles are available? Now a lot of these vendors are not very fond of cameras, but we think we know where we can go where they'll be kind to us and let us film some of this stuff. So I'm gonna do my best and give you guys a video letting you know what reptiles are in Chatu Chak. We're also gonna do some fish shopping, I think, if we see something that we really can't live without, but today is gonna to be reptiles. So let's go check it out. So this kind shop owner, he has a lot of very interesting animals, lots of Indonesia stock, and he's allowing us to go through and film. So basically we have Malinus monitors, Indicus, some Tribulonotus, and some blue tongue skinks. Interesting black tree monitors. And then over here, the standard ball pythons, there's some scrubs in there, some the Alberts, and that looks like about it. More Panoptes. More blue tongue skinks. And carpet. A couple green trees. And a meerkat running around. <laughs> it's gonna eat it's gonna eat the back sword. I mean the meal <laughs> <laughs> and a few things that I'm sure a bunch of you guys wish that you had. Got some black white lips here. I think he has four of them. Beautiful. It's very tame also. Yeah. So he has four here and I asked him if he knew the sex all males. I imported a huge amount and I had two females. I think it was 58.2. So that's kind of normal, normal answer that I would have expected. So the kind owner of the shop is letting me film just to kind of give you guys an idea. It's a lot of bread and butter stuff, non-native stuff. So I'm not even sure if I need to film these or not, but this is all ball pythons. We don't really do ball pythons on this channel. I think you guys get enough of those at the expos. So we'll move on. Here's another place. They're everywhere.
You guys, this is a cool one. This is not reptiles. This place is called Anter. Ants and accessories. This is crazy. Check this out. So there's no way, at least I assume that there's no way that we would be importing ants into the United States. But in a lot of other countries, in fact, Europe also, this is uh, pretty big stuff. Um, big elaborate displays, big colonies, ant colonies, and, and all that stuff. It's just, it's really cool. Um, this is the first time I've seen this store here, uh, but they got a lot of ants. They got more stuff I haven't, yeah, I missed it. Ants. Inside yeah. also those little square boxes over there, those are full of ants. And then they have some kind of like a scientific tube in yeah, the but, back. Yeah but, yeah, but look, do you see this tube right here? Yes, Where yes. the ants are going through? Mm. This whole thing comes yes. out of this cage right here. Yeah. Where it goes, I have no idea, but it's going down. Oh, it goes down to like a... The box. Yeah, like a dark, dark area. And these... Pretty wild, you guys. Ant colonies not coming soon to the US, I'm sure, but uh, very interesting. So we just bought a fly river turtle and a zebra shovel nose catfish from this particular person. So that's kind of like my ticket to film some stock here, like my admission fee. So always lots of turtles and tortoises here in Chatuchag. And there are quite a few here that I'll show you guys. Lots of sulcatas. Some red foots, leopards. like an aldabra and a couple sulcatas here. I'm hearing something, it sounds like a, a lamb or something. I don't know what that is. That was a goat. <laughs> I'll show you guys these goats real quick. They have everything in this place, I'm telling you. <laughs> All right, let me get back to Apple. So now I lost Apple. Stop to pet the baby goat. Turn around, gone. I have no idea where she went. place that we just got out of they always have the weirdest stuff the most bizarre things 
all kinds of different stuff. Not really supposed to be taking photo or video in there, but it is always a really crazy place. Little dirty shop. Those are usually the best. you guys that's gonna do it i know we missed a couple shops and it's so easy to get lost in this place but i think we got it pretty well covered almost exclusively non-native species that is pretty much what's going on in here native species they cracked down on that a long time ago lots of ball pythons green iguanas bearded dragons and some really cool indonesia stock stumps stuff that i have a problem getting myself it's difficult to obtain and they had some of that stuff here so that was cool to see um, the fish and stuff is always something interesting so we bought a tiger shovel nose catfish a zebra shovel nose catfish 200 of those little small schooling <laughs> fish i can't even remember the name of yeah, them yeah and what else did we buy apple fly river turtle mm -hmm. and i think that's it that's huh? it all right got some vitamins for the arowana tank and a couple t-shirts and we had lunch and that is it thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed that it was difficult to get um, a lot of footage here especially in those animal shops but apple was very polite and asked nicely and they allowed us to film so we got it for you guys and that is it we will see you in the next video thank you so much for watching take care at Sakonakon Airport so we are basically back home this is the first time for me we drove ourselves to the airport in our old truck and we left the truck parked here while we were gone parking is free which is unheard of in the US but uh, anyway so we left our vehicle we just got off the plane we're jumping in it and now we are headed to the bus station to see if our fish have arrived hopefully the timing is perfect and then we're gonna round them up and we are headed home. Timing was pretty good. We just had time to grab a quick bite to eat on the corner there. Same as you saw in a previous video, same place. This truck pulled up and we believe this is the truck that transported our fish. <laughs> Thank you.